Hey guys, it's Pandas. Uh, today I want to talk about angles, specifically the angle at which you should fly at. Now uh, this is an example of what a typical pilot in a public server would do. We'll fly nose to the ground at roughly a 30 degree angle and try to be as fast as possible. Uh, this has uh, certain uses, you know, when you're on a breakout, when you want to get to a destination very quickly because uh, the time is important, you want to fly as close um, to top speed as possible, and uh, this is what a lot of people do. But unfortunately, it's also what uh, many pilots uh, only do, and this has severe consequences for your gunners. Um, here are their uh, basic up and down, left and right movements when you're perfectly flat on the ground. See, as you can see, it lines up perfectly with the horizon and with targets on the ground, and you know, this happens when you're stationary, when you're floating down, um, and you're, it's very easy to engage targets. You just, if you want to test it out, just try a boat minigun and uh, notice how easy it is to get kills that way. This is what happens when you're perched at a severe angle. Uh, notice how your up and down, left and right mouse movements actually have both X and Y components, which can make it difficult, if not impossible, for your gunners to shoot ground targets effectively because of all the factors that they have to deal with, such as your elevation, angle, speed, any sudden sort of movements you make, uh, as well as the target's movements and the connection to the server. Uh, you can mitigate a lot of this just by pulling back on that stick a little bit and flying closer to being parallel to the ground. Uh, this is going to cut down on your speed, obviously. You're, it's about half the top speed, uh, but your gunners won't have to compensate as much for those tricky diagonals and uh, they'll thank you for that. They'll be very grateful uh, compared to flying nose to the ground like this. Um, and now there are situations where both styles are going to come into play. You know, not every situation is going to call for flying kind of slower and uh, better for your gunners. Like if, for example, if you're facing armor and they've caught you in a bad position, you don't want to be limping away. You want to get there as, out of there as fast as possible. Uh, but on the other hand, if, if you want to engage a bunch of infantry and there's no immediate threats, uh, setting up that shot can be much more important um, and much more effective. So uh, keep that in mind. You have to be the judge of uh, the situation and to decide you know, what's appropriate. Thanks for watching the video, and we'll see you next time.